This video was made to demonstrate some new features of Smart Camera View 2.85. Other versions may have some differences. New Render Output Preset Interface The preset button will now act as a check button, with the Render Output Presets interface smaller, more modern, and easier to use. Although there are some small adjustments in the way it works, most of the functions remain the same. The Render Output Preset panel will also integrate the Save Dialog State and Sticky Dialog features in the script system settings, make it neater when used on the screen. New Start with 3ds Max option This option will cause the script to be enabled on 3ds Max startup. It will help you quickly browse the cameras included in the scene. New Update Render Setup Dialog option According to Autodesk, Changing the Render Setup dialog settings via Max script should be done with the actual Render Setup dialog in a closed state. Leaving the dialog open will make the attempted Max script modifications non-sticky. Therefore, normally, when you switch the camera with the Render Setup dialog on, the parameters here will not change automatically. That's why this option is added to the script to fix that. Currently, there will be four options, of which two methods are used to update the parameters of the Render Setup dialog automatically. Update Dialog and Restart Dialog. The Update Dialog method will update the parameters of the render setup without closing this window, however it may not be compatible with some renderers. The Restart Dialog method will close the render setup dialog before switching the camera, and reopen the panel after switching. This is the slowest of all the methods, yet it is compatible with almost all renderers. New Separator Character option. You can customize the characters used to separate the data in the camera name. More matching characters will be added in upcoming updates. Please email me if you want to make suggestions. And many more fixes and improvements. Learn more at d95design.com. Thanks for watching. See you next time.